Hey guys, Miss Stone. So this is the frequently asked questions about resin number two. And this time I'm going to talk about drilling your resin pieces to put the screw eye pins into them. So now, for drilling with a Dremel tool. I have a Dremel 4000 and I use an extension to it, which is the flex shaft, I think is the name of the thing. And what it does is that you can hang your tool somewhere and you can use it like a pan. It's much lighter and easier to deal with. The bit that I'm using here, and it's the 364th, the second smallest drill bit that you find for your Dremel tool. This one's too small for the screw eye pin I'm using. And if you're using a screw eye pin bigger than the one that I'm going to show you now, you should use a bigger bit. Otherwise, either the eye pin will break or the piece. So this is a 10 millimeter screw eye pin. You can get this on Etsy. And, well, that's the only place I can get it from, so that's the only tip I have. As you can tell, this Dremel tool, you can choose which speed it will drill. And I always leave it between 10,000 RPM and 15,000 RPM. If you do it much faster, it will be easier for you to make a mistake. And if you make it much slower, it's going to take you a while to drill. So I usually don't wear any protective gear to deal with my resin, but the only thing I will always wear when I'm dealing with my Dremel tool or any kind of drill is protective glasses. And the reason for that is especially for us who's, who are dealing with very small drill bits, they're very, uh, they're easier to break than the regular drill bits you use for drills. So if they break, they will fly, and you don't want your eyes to be in the way. I'm not going to be very graphical about this, but you really don't want that to happen. So, if you're a kid, ask an adult to help you, but this should work for everyone. Always, when d dealing with a drill or a Dremel tool, use protective glasses. It's better safe than sorry. I really hope this helped. If you still have any doubts after watching this, don't hesitate to leave your comment down below and stay tuned for the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Talk to you guys later and bye bye.